got the live timing going right now, so I'm trying to keep an eye on what's going on. So we got three trucks here today, I believe only three, and all three of them are in the pro class. So Pat is out on course, just to my left right now. And here's Sean, these guys are on their first lap of the day. So Pat just went a 45-4 which being first lap, that puts him in first place. Take a look at the times here. Oh. So we've been experiencing some technical difficulties with timing. So as you can see, the timer is still running and it just stopped right there. So technically that will not count as Sean's first run. He will get another first run. Which, of course, is an advantage. The more laps, the better. Here is Michael Williams. I apologize for butchering the last names the last time. So it's gonna be a battle between these three guys today. They're always so close. So 45-0. I mean, I hate to say anything, Sean, even though he didn't trip the timers, but I think Sean had him by a little bit on his first lap. So that would technically be Michael's first lap. Sean will come back around for his second first lap. All right, sorry, missed the first half of this lap. I had to run over to the timing tent and confirm that Sean's lap was uh, DNF, what do you want to call it? The timers were messed up. Well, that would have put him in first. That was a 43.9, but he got a cone out there on the slalom. You can see them cleaning it up. All right, so here comes Michael. Pretty sure this is lap two. Again, stay pretty sure. Let me take a look at the times here. Okay, no, this is lap three. So Michael's quickest so far is a 45-0, sitting in first place right now. Looking to improve. And he does. 44-2. I don't see any cone workers moving around. So I think that is clean. Let me refresh the page here and see what it says. All right, so here's Pat. This is Pat's second lap. He's got a 45-4. He's got to pick up a second just to close the gap and go a little bit farther to get back in first. Again, he held first for all of about 15 seconds there in that first run. Look at that thing glimmer in the sun. Yeah, good lap he does. He does pick up a second, but not enough to move him up. Alright, this is officially the second lap for Sean in the C10. Had some timing malfunctions. So Pat still has one more lap to run. Sean is currently sitting in third. Let's see if he can get through the slalom clean. That's where he got the cone the last time. Oh, and he got another one. Forty-four one. That would have been enough to put him in second, but technically the other lap would have been enough to put him in first. But that cone he's kicking up there is important. He stacks up there. All right, another improvement for Pat. Not enough to move him up though. Still sitting in second, but raise the bar a little bit. Trying to see where Harrison moved. So Sean, whoa, what the deuce? All right, well, I'm gonna mention something here. 
it ain't gonna matter for him today because yeah he just beat that but they had Sean sitting in first right now after that last lap even though he got a cone I witnessed that cone getting hit doesn't matter anyways that lap he just went 43 6 and I'm pretty darn certain it was clean Second session, final laps here. This is going to be Truck, truck Pro. Sean, Michael, and Pat all about battling it out here. Sean currently sitting in first with the 43.6. Michael sitting in second with the 43.7. We knew these guys were gonna battle this weekend and here it is. So Sean has not improved in this second session. That's still a holdover from the first. And he just does a couple hundreds, but hey, 43.5, I'll take it. All right, well, Michael just ran the same time, 43.7. I believe the Pat is sitting in third right now, but he had a fast lap earlier. They got a cone. So yeah, Pat had a 43-3. It would have put him in first, but got a cone on it. So this truck battle in this last session is gonna be interesting. So that was Pat's first run, third session. But we got Michael and Sean coming up next. So Sean is still sitting in first with a 43.6. But he better improve because we got two other trucks in here ready to go even faster. Always a battle with these guys. Harrison's getting ready to start his lap right now. Oh, 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 that's a spin. Yeah, go through it backwards, 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 backwards. Do it, do it, yes. All right. That is called pulling an effort. So this will be Michael's second lap even though he's had a bunch. Timer's messing up. It actually kind of worked out good because dudes are getting more laps today. I got an extra one in the first session. So even though on paper I only have nine laps, yeah, Sean, or Michael here's probably got 12 or 13 because of all the timing issues. All right, 44 one not gonna be an improvement. It's so hard to keep track of what's actually the last lap, the first lap anymore. The live timing shows that this is lap nine for Pat. Trying to go better in a 43.8. There is only two tenths separating these three trucks. Pat's in third, Michael's in second. And Sean is in first. So 43.8 is where Pat is right now, but he's got to go better in a 43.6. 44.14. Okay. So Sean, again, eight laps showing. This should be his ninth and final. Hoping to move forward, of course, raise the bar, but a 43.6 is his quickest. Nope, 43.7. So if in fact that was his last run, Michael is the only one that can knock him out right now. All right, well, Pat's lined up again, so I, uh, I'm not quite sure what exactly is going on, but here comes Michael and what should be his last lap. 43.9 is not going to improve. So even Sean's lined up again too. So 
I can only assume that this will be Pat's last lap. Looking to improve on a 43.8. The start was much better on this lap. Close. This is a really good lap right here. Well, another 43.8. Not enough to move up. So, again, if that was Pat's last lap, which it looks like he's pulling around the pits, that will leave him in third. I'm trying to look around and see where Michael's at, see if he's lined up again. But I do believe this is Sean's last lap that should just be a glory lap unless Michael's around there lined up. Apologize for all these timing messes. I'm trying to keep track on the live timing. Again, it would be good for Sean to just lay down a number right now. Raise the bar. All right, got clean through the slalom up there. This is gonna be a good lap too. He does. 43-4-3-5. Again, I'll double check that live timer and make sure that was clean. But yes, raise that bar again. Oh, Kelly is on a roll. Ran a 43.4 in his uh, step slide truck. Sean Kelly. Yeah. Top guy in truck pro. Oh, yeah, we didn't have a truck guy this time. You're scoping your spot, right? Yeah. <laughs>